Um, I I had a headache, and you know, of course, I had played five more than five hours, and and you know, it was a hot day, uh, and I did ice bath after. Um, I did stretch, and you know, just rest, rest my body. You haven't been on an IV or anything like that. No need for that. Sorry. No need for an IV or anything like that. Um, no. How do you, that was a remarkable match, and congratulations on the win, um, facing a, a very, very good opponent. Yeah. Your thoughts about, about what you were able to do today, persevere in that heat for five hours and, and, and beat the likes of Chile? Um, I knew he had good serve and uh, good second serve, and I was thinking that was it, it, it is key to break his second serve. Uh, I was uh, not returning well uh, until third or fourth set and start start uh, more attack his uh, second serve and um, <coughs> just I was just slicing and just putting and uh, you know it was walking and after after the serve I was able to uh, um, hit winners and and. Uh, <coughs> I was cramping uh, third, second or third set, uh, and I uh, um, think that was key for set tie break. Um, 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 yeah. You've had you've had a bad luck with injuries. Um, the past year or two, and, yeah. and and the fact that you are able to um, get through a match like that, a five rounds, and under such difficult conditions, and be on the court for so long, do you, can you look look at that as a as maybe something that can give you confidence going forward into the tournament that you're able to persevere to, to win a tournament in, in, under those conditions? Um, I was struggling after after come back. I was not playing for 11 or 12 months and I thought I lost I lost everything uh, my feeling and my tennis and but I started getting confidence I was winning challenges uh, won three challenges already already and uh, um, before this uh, two weeks ago uh, I won Binghamton Challenger and played really well there and started getting confidence and uh, um, yeah it was it was difficult from Corey's it was raining and I had to wait two days to finish uh, three days to finish the first match and and uh, yeah like today it was hot and played five hours so but I you know I beat his top player obviously and uh, Played well today, so I'm getting more confidence from this tournament. Hey, I, I know you got asked uh, about it courtside. I think it was Pam Shriver. But it's 15 years since Shuzo Matsuoka um, had a, an infamous match out there when he was in agony with cramp. Yeah. Now you were obviously a very young kid when when that happened, but you obviously know Shuzo. Have you, have you talked to him about that experience? Yeah, I've seen him many times on. Uh, on TV, um, yeah, it was it was always too sad to see that because no one can help, and you know he just has to um, lay down and couldn't do anything. So, and I used to cramp a lot, and um, even two years ago I played here, and I was cramping from first match, and I was able to finish that, but. Um, you know the rules changing now, and it's more tough to tough when you're clamping, clamp. So, um, but nothing I can change. But were, were you afraid that when you start? I mean, you said you started cramping in in the second set, which is early. Yeah. Were, were you, when you got into a fifth, were you afraid that something really unpleasant might happen? I was thinking about it uh, in uh, fourth set mostly. Uh, even if I win this, I have to.
play one more set and uh, it's not going to be easy for me and you know cramping so but I was able to fight through uh. so does this give you more satisfaction than anything you've achieved in tennis so far coming um, through that match coming through five hours in that heat after after came back yeah um, played five set in French too but uh, it wasn't hot and it was tough but even uh, today was hot hot and I was cramping so yeah it was uh, uh, tough match I was going to ask you to compare it actually to the Ferrer match in 2008 when you reached the fourth round yeah. would you rate this higher than that? Uh, what, what do you mean would, would you say that this would that this was the most satisfying match between the two? Um, um, you know, it was both both good match uh, for me. I have more more good memories there uh, against Pelero. Uh, I won first this set and he came back, but I was still fighting and um, uh, and uh, it was first time round of 16, and I was really happy about it.